decorative legs that give the stove a bit of height. Your air controls are quite discreetly hidden here. And then you've got your beveled cast iron door. It's also portrait, which gives you a good view of the flame picture when the fire's lit. A hand is prune. And inside, as you can see, your ash pan, your great bar with the Mizuno logo on it, and your Vermicky Light bricks and all are in there as well. The stove is multi-fuel, so you can burn your choice of kiln and dry wood with 20% or less moisture, or smoke with solid fuel. The stove is also EcoDesign 2022 approved. What this means is the environmental impact of the stove is greatly reduced. As the burn is cleaner, the particulate emissions produced by the stove are a lot less compared to what would be in a traditional open fire or a traditional stove. So today I'm going to light the stove with wood. I already have my kindling in here. And as you can see, I've got a fire lighter just underneath. And what I'll do is I'll pull out both air controls to let as much air into the stove chamber as possible. Once I get my matches and the light, the fire lighters, I'll also keep the door slightly ajar, just touching the little clip. And that'll just, again, keep as much air going into the stove chamber as possible. So now that I'm ready to light the stove, open the door, Get my matches. starting to catch I'll add a log or two and um, a good thing to remember is that the bark on the logs will catch quicker than the actual log themselves so I'll put the same bark down. With every Mizuna stove you get a Mizuna gauntlet so always use it to be careful when you're adding logs. Now when you open the door don't scare it but just open it nice and slowly and that will stop the flames coming out at you and just use your hand with your glove set that in there. I'll only add one for now and um, we'll see how it goes. I'll leave it like that for now. Both air controls still fully open. You can see the fire is burning very rapidly there and that is because there's so much air coming through the air controls.